Hello everyone, this is Retro Lizard coming at you. Uh, I am going to show you a demonstration of this uh, playlist that we're doing here for our Star Wars yoke. Um, the, you're not, I'm not going to show you the yoke right now, but I'll post pictures onto my page. Um, this specific mod is for Star Wars games only. We have a new crawl for this too, which is pretty sweet. This is our new video for the Star Wars category. You might have seen my Star Wars mods before, where I've only put Star Wars games on it. This has a lot more than that, obviously. Um, so we have our Star Wars playlist here, with 18 Star Wars games. Then we also added flying games. It's 457 flying games. We have our racing category, which I've showed you my racing mod before. This one is utilizing the Star Wars yoke. There are 674 racing games on this machine. That's it, 674. And we also made a shooter category for shoot 'em ups. Um, those are pretty much like your vertical games uh, for your vertical shoot 'em ups. Uh, I've gone through, I've tried to trim the playlist down. There are 1,430 shoot 'em ups on this cab. The total amount of games that are on here, I can't exactly give you um, uh, the uh, total amount, but um, this pretty much, we, what I do is I take my, my big box build, which is two terabytes, and I turn that into the playlist. And so when you turn the machine on, all you get is the playlist. So we're going to go into some games here. We have a new Star Wars game that we want to show you. Hopefully I added it to the category and I didn't forget. <laughs> Here's our Star Wars playlist. Uh, we have the arcade game for, uh, this is the Atari version. Empire Strikes Back, the Atari version. Uh, this is the Empire Strikes Back arcade game. Return of the Jedi arcade game. Star Wars, the arcade game. Episode 1 for Nintendo 64. Uh, this one's for Game Boy Color. Rogue Squadron 2 for GameCube. Trilogy. Of course, Battle Pod, one of the main reasons why people mod this machine in the first place. Star Wars Demolition, Demolition for the Dreamcast, this one was for PS1, Episode 1 Racer for the Dreamcast. This is the new game. This is Star Wars Racer, the arcade game. Let's give this one a shot. Turn some volume up here a little bit too. I'm using my monitor in my house um, that I use for programming. So I have a Star Wars arcade, but it's not modified. So I can't specifically modify it to give you the demonstration of this, obviously. So we're just gonna do this right here on the monitor, just like this. Get some more volume up here. Sometimes the games are quiet. Uh-oh, here we go. We are using the yoke. Get out of my way. Oh man, I crashed. <laughs> there we go.
it's kind of a quiet game apparently but once we get this into an actual arcade and get some speakers hooked up to it that are better this thing will most likely be a lot louder i assume bam i'm gonna hit the wall again There we go. That's Pod Racer, the arcade game. I gotta set the joy to key for this. There we go. That's Pod Racer, the arcade game. You've seen this list before. Uh, we can do a quick demo of Battle Pod, of course. Battle Pod's right here. Go to Battle Pod. Of course, Techno Parrot Games takes some of the longest to actually load up and run. This game definitely takes a while to load. <laughs> We're going at almost two minutes already. Throttle works, brake works. Throttle works, brake works. All right, here we go.
thought I missed it. All right, well, this is Battle Pod. You guys get the point of this one. shut down there we go we shut down all right so there you go so there's that let's back out and let's go to the racing category shall we so 657 racing games are in here i'm sure there's a couple in here that i missed that are probably not racing games i mean there's just so many so there's wipeouts Wave Runners. Let's do this one, huh? <clears throat> Alright, maybe that one didn't work. You know, with the amount of games that are on here, they're not all going to work. So let's try this Wave Runner game. But 99% of the games work. I guarantee it. Of course, you got to run into a few that don't, just like we just did just now. And with that being said, when I'm done with this video, I'll probably go back in and delete it from the system so it doesn't even show back up. <laughs> what was that? Going sideways. Oh man. All right. <laughs> All right. Well, that was Wave Runner. Uh, what's this one? Wave Race? That's for Game Boy. What else we got going on here? Uh, virtual racing. Um, this one. This is the arcade version of virtual racing. My cat's behind me scratching on my chair. <laughs> Here we go. driving of it, that's all. I mean, this yoke is so nice with the racing games. I mean, it's it's unbelievable how nice it is. It's better than the racing wheel that I have. I have the Thrustmaster TMX, and the yoke just runs a lot better. It's so good that I'm probably going to end up modifying my Star Wars cab for the racing games. Oops, get control of this thing. Here we go. Come on. 
there's Virtual Racing. Let's go into some more. We have some new Techno Parrot Racing games too. Uh, we have R Tuned. Uh, you can also go alphabetically here. So let's go over to the R's. We're looking for R Tuned. Look at all the road rashes. <laughs> There's so many. Did our tune not make it to the list? There it is, our tuned. I'm like, I know it's in here. Do, 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 techno parent taking forever to load up. Feel good. Feel good. What do we got here for cars? Corvette? No, we don't want that. I'll take the Supra though. Give me green. I believe I have the boosters attached to the steering wheel also, to the top triggers. This is definitely a drifting game. That was a nice drift. This game is awesome, man. It's a nice racing game. I 
All right, so that's our tuned. What else we got? We got, I've got San Francisco Rush. Uh, I have the arcade version. This is the arcade version right here. So let's do some San Francisco Rush. This is probably going to be a long video too, so I'll make sure I put some edits up in there. Again, when you have this into your cab and you have the volume turned up on it, you'll be good to go. We also have San Francisco Rush the Rock too. Ah, oh, I crashed it. Damn it. Usually I make that. said the steering with this yoke oh my god it is awesome of course i'm in eighth place but that's because i crashed no big deal it's the fun of the game that i get out of it So that's Rush. Classic San Francisco Rush, the arcade game. We also have Rush 2049. Uh, we have the PlayStation version. We have the Nintendo 64 version. Something called Superbike. Scud Race. Uh, let's try that one. screen on the TV either so you know when you have this in your actual cab it should look a lot better and it should go to full screen too Ooh, 
Christmas cards all over the place. <laughs> All right, that's Scud Race. Let's see what else games we got, racing games we got here. Uh, it's Sega Classic, Sega GT, Sega Rally, SR33 for Ring Edge. Um, this is also a Techno Parrot game too. This is a Sega Rally 3. So that's also a Techno Parrot game too. Um, what else we got here that we can go at? Uh, what about Spy Hunter? Pretty sure I have Spy Hunter. Look at me, I'm questioning myself here, but it should be on this list. Hang on. Split second. Spy Hunter. Is this the arcade version? It should be. Yep. Oh, no, wait, this is 2600. We want... The arcade version. GameCube. This should be it. Yep, 1983 arcade. Hmm. I guess it's not loaded. Maybe it doesn't work. What about this Spy Hunter? What's this? That looks like Spy Hunter Pinball. Yeah, we don't want that. Uh, this is the Nintendo version. Let's go to the Nintendo version. Oh, <laughs> you got to press up in order for it to drive. That's Spy Hunter for Nintendo. What else can we do? How about Daytona? We got a couple versions of Daytona actually. But let's go to the classic. Daytona USA. It's like a Saturn. This should be it.
go. That's the 20 USA, the classic version. The OG version. But we also have Daytona USA number two. Also, we have this one and we have this one. This is Power Edition. This is Battle on the Edge Edition. Let's do this one. on this too it's amazing the wheel on this too the axis oh my god just even more smooth Daytona to the classic edition with the yoke. Uh, what else can we show off here with the yoke? Um, this is Death Race. That's Nintendo. Destruction Derby. Let's try Destruction Derby. This is a console game. God, I haven't played this game in years either. This game came out when I was in high school.
guys get the point of that. So that's destruction derby. That's on the council game. Let's, let's go to Road Rash. the Sega version. Where's the Sega version? Here we go. Let's do Road Rash 3. What? Alright. Looks like we gotta reload the Sega games here. That's weird. What the hell, man? Alright, so we gotta reload some Sega games. So we're not almost ready to go. But we're getting there. Where is... That's weird that it's not there because I was playing Afterburner the other day on 32X. Alright, let's get out of this category. Got lost in the mix. Let's go to flying. So we have 457 of these. So let's go right to let's go to Afterburner. Where is Afterburner? Let's go to Afterburner Climax. Here we go. Afterburner Climax. Also a Techno Parrot game. Techno Parrot games take forever to load up, man. Select aircraft. Super Top Gap. Afterburner Climax. My battery's dying over here on my phone, so let's get through a couple more games. So it's Afterburner Climax. Um, I've showed you Afterburner before. I don't even know where to go with gun games. Let's try this one, Alpha Mission 2. Never even played it. Alright, Neo Geo. Cool.
This is a fun game. Alright, let's get out of that. That was fun. Um, what other gun? I mean, there's. I don't even know where to start for flying games here, man. Um, I really don't. That looks like a Neo Geo 2. What about... I think I have a game called Gunblade. Gradius. Oh yeah, we got the Gradius games. Let's not forget about those. Gunlock. Gunbird. Maybe Gunblade is in the shooters. Unless I went buy it, go for Gunbird. No. Let's go to Gradius. Classic. Oops, hit the wrong button. All right, let's go back into Gradius 2 then. some reason I think that the global maps don't always go over into the games yeah so I'm not sure why but it's gonna work now nope I died already Get out of that. <laughs> and there you have it. That's Gradius. Where is? Let's check. It's one of the shooters. And let's check. I'm pretty sure Gunblade's in here. Then, if it's not in the other one, you got the Galaga's in here. You know, these are all the good shooters that are on the system. Well, obviously, Gauntlet's not a shooter, so we got to take that out of there. So like I said, there's going to be some games that snuck in here. Um, where is Gunblade? G-Lock, Golgo, got to get those out of there. Gradius, Gorf. Gradius games are in here too. QRS. Guardian Legend. Got to get that out of there too. Uh, Gundam's in here. Oh man, I really wanted to show you Gunblade too, because I have it, but I guess I gotta make sure that I add it, because it's not sitting here in the list. So, alright, well, I mean, these are the gun games, or the, these are the shoot 'em ups. Um, pretty much almost the same flying games, probably, that are in the flying category, plus about a thousand more. Uh, I gotta get some games out of here. Um, Let's check. Let's do Gorf.
And there's Gorf. Um, just a Gradius. So yeah, so those are the, so there it is. There's a system. Uh, I'll have some more demos too on the next game. Yes, Resident Evil Biohazard 2 is a game that we've also obtained. It does work. You need control sticks for that. That's not a yoke game at all. Um, let's try this game. Sounds like it's Neo Geo. This is a fun game too. I'm into this, this is fun. Come on, give me those bombs, damn it. What the fuck? Oh yeah, I'm gonna kill this guy. Got him. Okay. What game was this? Gunbird. I gotta play the hell out of this game now. <laughs> Especially on my regular system. So, alright guys, there you have it. This is my Yoke mod. Uh, this is the Yoke playlist for shooters, uh, racing games, flying games, I love that. And Star Wars. So thank you guys for watching as always. Um, sorry that I couldn't show you what it looked like in a cabinet. Um, but, you know, like I said, I don't have my Star Wars modded. And this is just a yoke mod that we're going to be shipping off to somebody um, in another state. So and we appreciate everybody's patience. I'm waiting on their mods. Um, you know, most of these games are actually all of these games are on everybody's computer uh, that we mod for them. So if you get a PC mod from us or the PC add-on mod from us, every single one of these games that you see in this video are on it no matter what. Whether you have a racing cab, a two-player cab, four-player cab, every single one of these games are on there, man. So thanks again for watching.